So Nick discovered this beauty, believe it or not, at the bottom of a lake. And that's a fascinating story. What happens is every year the lake by our cottage is drained to make hydroelectric power. But this year for some unknown reason, they drained it way beyond anything I've seen before since I've been going out there. So we were walking along on this newly revealed lunar looking surface and then he chanced upon this vintage toy gun between the rocks. And it's got to be at least 20 or 30 years old judging from the fact that it's beautiful carvings, it's die cast metal and it's also made in Italy. All of the cap guns today are made of plastic and made in China. So I decided to restore it because it was just fascinating to me. The thought that 20 or 30 years ago, some middle-aged guy here in town had a terrible day as a kid when he lost his cap gun overboard in the lake. He would never have imagined that today there'd be some kids playing with that same gun that he had when he was a kid. So the first step was to mask it with painter's tape and then I started by spray painting the body with metallic silver. Then I reversed the painter's tape and covered the body and then painted the stock and the tip orange um, for legal purposes. The whole process took about an hour all in all and this is the final product. And now for the so final fellas. reveal to my kids. Remember that gun that you guys found under the lake? Yeah. Well, look what I did with it. I have yeah. restored it. You guys want to check it out? Does that even look like the same gun? I have restored it to its former glory. What do you think, little Nick? Good. Well, let's say bye-bye. Bye. -bye. bye. bye.